Looks like you got my invitation. Just you and me. Come on! Not so fast, Deathstroke. He's my kill. Find a body. No. And next time, keep your other assassins out of my way. You had your shot, Deathstroke. But you're not the only assassin in town. And the night is young. Two minutes.
better than this, Clark. These inmates are irredeemable. They're thieves, rapists, murderers, like the Joker. That's the problem with fighting for truth and justice. The battle never ends. And executing them will end it? First Joker, now this. When does it stop? When there's no more crime. When people can live without fear. We want the same thing, Bruce. I wanted to kill my parents' murderer. I could have. But that's not the life they wanted for me. And it's not the life Lois would want for you. Don't you put that on me. A red solar grenade. To dull your powers, you need to stop. Take time to grieve before it's too late. You wouldn't. You're supposed to be my friend. Which is why I have to stop you. Now. Get away from me. Look who I found. Victor Saz. Psychopath. How many women have you killed? <laughs> hundred... Twenty-one. A hundred and twenty-one. Huh. Sounds incorrigible to me. Robin, let him go! You'd rather fight your friends than the real problem. I'm warning you, son. Son? You didn't raise me. The League of Assassins did. <laughs> Problem solved. Who's next? Damn it, Damien! We are at war with these animals. You think you're better than him? You let the Joker keep on killing. You couldn't save Lois or Jason or anyone! That's enough. Let's go. But the inmates... Not today. hours we break the yoke of oppression forever no more regime no more justice league today the world welcomes its new masters the society Self-esteem, not that guy's problem. That's a lot more than a few society members. It's all of them. They're headed indoors, out of sight from the soldiers. Harley, keep the jet warm. When we signal, bail us out. Laid it on a little thick, Grodd. You hire Superman's speechwriter? Soldiers must be properly motivated to sacrifice their lives, Catwoman. Hate is the perennial motivator. Better not turn that hate on us, or this society is over. 
As long as we have a common agenda, Captain Cold, you have nothing to fear. You mean as long as we follow your orders? Report, Deadshot. We're ready to move out. Good dog. Now go tell the others. Cheetah, Cold, you're with the first wave. We already lost the shipment at Slaughter Swamp. Hope your silent partner can still deliver. Maybe it's time you spilled the identity of our silent partner, since we're relying so much on him, or her. He will soon make his presence known, but for now... First, a few words from the brave and the bold. <laughs> I'm the brave one, right? I'm not bold enough to disagree. The saboteurs of Slaughter Swamp, I presume. <laughs> Handle this. Where's that damn dirty ape? I come to you as darkness falls. Dr. Fate? Dinah Lance, Oliver Queen. In the past, I have shielded you from danger, but a grave crisis looms. And I do not know if I can stop it. You mean Grodd and company? We've got that covered. Grodd is the pawn of a much greater master. A new order is coming. I have foreseen it. Leave with me now, while I can still save you. If that's the case, we're staying here. Batman will need our help. Everyone and everything you know will die. I will shepherd you to safety, lest you suffer the same fate. By force, if necessary. The good doctor's been wearing that helm for too long. Then let's help him out of it. Watch my back. He should not have returned to Batman. You are not fated to fight his battle. Well, like a good friend once told me. Screw fate. I'm not abandoning Batman. You okay? Your headgear really had you going. I lost control of Naboo, the spirit of the helm. Thanks to you, I'm back in charge, for now. I have to go consult my masters, the Lords of Order. Pray they'll intervene before it's too late. Too late for what, Kent? What's going down? The Lord's magic bars me from saying more. I have changed fate too many times. This planet's destiny is no longer clear. What comes next? Mere mortals cannot stop. For better or worse, your fate rests in the gods' hands. That was... spooky. Yeah. Come on, let's find Grodd and get the hell out of here. We're happy to check out, but you're coming with us. Fighting a talking ape wasn't enough. Had to throw in telekinesis. Give us a song to soothe these savage beasts. Ah, uh, I forgot to bring my banana arrow. Wait, you eat bananas, right? Or is that an offensive stereotype? You ignorant fool! Bagging me. I was just trying to be PC.
Surprised that worked. Let's call it a day and get Harley out of here. <laughs> it's never good when you slap the cuffs on and then they start chuckling. Humans. <laughs> you've won this battle, but you've already lost the war. I got nothing. Your victory over Gorilla Grodd warrants further study. Green skin. Smart money's on alien. Uh, Martian? Like John John's? My point of origin was a thousand light years removed from Mars on the planet Kolu. I am Brainiac. Resistance begets violence. Then we won't resist. Please, just stop! You're the grave crisis we were warned about. What do you want? I seek the one you call Superman. For years, I believed I had destroyed Krypton and all its remnants. Superman's survival is an oversight I must correct. Superman's no friend of ours. I am aware. But your planet has also piqued my interest. Its many contradictions are fascinating. We'll never serve you. Serve? I am no petty despot. I collect worlds, preserving their essential knowledge to enhance my intellect. And then I discard the remnants. Why? Your species values precious metals, arbitrary symbols of status. I value knowledge. And like your metal trinkets, knowledge is more valuable when it is rare. Brother I, give me an update on the team at Gorilla City. I cannot do that, Bruce Wayne of Earth. Why not? Because I am not Brother I. I am Brainiac. You cannot regain control. Over the past days, Brother I has been absorbed into my neural network. It is now an extension of my mind. You, a fragile human, captured and imprisoned a fully developed male Kryptonian. Maybe I'm not so fragile. To prevail, you harnessed advanced sciences, nanotechnology, satellite communications, interdimensional transits. I am taking these tools from you. Why? The Kryptonian belongs to me. And soon, so will your planet.
Terra. Where else besides Metropolis? Gotham, Beijing, Moscow. So many cities, all at once. It's him. Who, Kara? Who is it? We need to get Cal. Now! has returned to action. The task force is ready. I'll enjoy this. Nice aim, Deadshot. Just get the job done. That knee ain't healing super fast at absolute zero. Uh, for God's sake, Cold, look around! Yeah, crazy day. Kinda like when Superman went nuts and you went right along with him. Punish me later. We have to help these innocent people. The same innocent people who cheered Superman when he executed my friends? My sister? I'm sorry, Cold. But you never hurt civilians. You're better than that! Once upon a time, I was. Guess we both let each other down. I was hoping you was Bruce's mole. For all the good it did, Grodd never trusted me enough to share the whole alien invasion plan. We gotta help Dinah and Ollie. We will. First, we need to get back to Gotham, if there's anything left of it. Retirement will do that to you. <laughs> What's with you, Lawton? You should be fighting this invasion. <laughs> Got no choice. Grod put a nano explosive in my head. Hit pause on the trigger. <laughs> 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 So whether I like it or not, I gotta do Grodd's dirty work. You're dead, you just don't know it. I know. It's just business. <laughs> I 
God said you couldn't resist a good crisis. Eobard Thawne? You don't belong here. And miss the return of Barry Allen? from the future to hurt you, Barry. But this timeline, it's all wrong. So go back to your own time, Reverse Flash. You think I haven't tried? Your regime buddies killed one of my ancestors. And now I'm trapped in a paradox. I can never go home. But at least I can hurt you! How many more reunions I can take? Guess I could come back later. Hal? No, not today. Nice to see you too, Barry. Whose dead hand do you pry that ring from? You know it doesn't work that way. The ring chose me. Even after you bailed on the Guardians to join the Sinestro Corps? The Guardians locked me up. But they also trained me to overcome my fears. I earned the second chance they gave me. All day I've been reminded how I failed to be a hero. How hard it's going to be to regain people's trust. Guess we're both on that path. We have a long way to go, Barry. It'd be a lot easier if we were together. Where should we start? We don't have much time. Batman's strategy is all wrong. Delaying our offensive is pointless. It's one less hour before Brainiac sends us all to Hades. Saving these people could doom billions more. I can hear the people down there. All of them. They're afraid, like I was on Krypton when I didn't have these powers. And I look at us and I just think, we can give them hope. Welcome back, Diana.
Your heart's so cold, Wonder Woman. Let's put you on ice. Nice rope a dope. So, you're one of Flash's enemies? Jeez, how new are you, kid? Not so new I can't take you. Eobard Thawne, right? Barry said you're some kind of time traveler. Yeah, and let me tell you about the future. You think you're immortal, but in my time, Diana, you're quite dead. An oracle you are not. Diana, you're safe. Thank Rao. We have to find Kara. She's... We will. Clark, we don't have time for... Please. I've missed you. We can beat them, Cal. Brainiac, Batman, they both go down today. And we'll rule, side by side, as equals. And lovers. I turned to you when Lois died. You took advantage. Manipulated my grief. Turned me into someone I wasn't meant to be. That's not true. My love made you stronger. Is that what you tell yourself? <sighs> That's what Superman told me, Scarecrow. <laughs> You're not afraid of Superman. You're afraid you corrupted him. Brave hero. Your worst fear is becoming the villain of the story. To Hades with your mind games. Classic anger displacement. We should continue your therapy. are vulnerable to magic. <laughs> and these claws cut like magic. Hang in there, Kara. The gods will protect us. <gasps> Minerva. I'm surprised someone so feral still follows Grodd's orders. No, princess. I only joined Grodd to draw out my own quarry. You. A fool's errand. Like when you sought a god's power but found the cheetah's curse. More like the cheetah's gift. I'm stronger, faster, and thirsty. So thirsty. For Amazon blood. You all right, Blondie? Sit tight. She's had enough, 
ones of bread. This isn't your business, clown. You heard bats. No killing. You lecture me. How much blood is on your ledger, Quinn? Oh, buckets full, honey. I was trying too hard to impress the wrong guy. Kind of like you with Superman. you before you make a mistake that lunatic deserves to die maybe but she's defenseless she's had no trial you told me Amazon's fought with honor <laughs> you're gonna be okay I'll get you to a doctor. Cal can protect you. Superman? <laughs> oh, Blondie. You're funny. Did you find anything? I analyzed the Kryptonian data like you asked. You didn't miss anything. They just didn't have an answer for Brainiac. There has to be something. A blind spot, a weakness. Brute force won't be enough. If your powers are restored, I should leave for Kandak. Make sure its defenses are prepared. Brainiac hasn't attacked it yet? The Rock of Eternity's magic hides Kandak from prying eyes, even Brainiac's. But I don't expect him to be fooled forever. Cal, we need to talk. Give me a minute, both of you. Damien told me what happened. Is Diana all right? She's fine. But she was gonna kill Harley. I've never seen her so cold-blooded. Yes, it's unfortunate. I know. What was she thinking? It's unfortunate Diana chose now to deal with Harley. More unfortunate that you got in the way. What? The Joker sickened Harley's mind beyond healing. When she relapses, innocent people will die. Innocent people are dying now. She was helping us. Don't be naive, Kara. Harley's a criminal. My only mistake was not dealing with her sooner. Diana said the Joker was executed. Were you the one who- I took one life to save millions. But it wasn't just one, Cal, was it? How many? How many? Everywhere I go, people are afraid of this. Now I know why. It's not how I wanted things, but humans. They've been slaughtering each other for millennia. I stopped that violence. Humans need strong leadership. We have to save them from themselves. Whose son are you? jor -El's? Or General Zod's? Kara! Don't let Kara leave the fortress. Hold on, Kara. I'm realizing maybe your father locked you up for good reason. You will submit, Kara Sorel. Ever since you found me, everything you told me, half-truths, lies, to cover up your own evil. You see the world as a child does. Good and evil are not constants. Listen to me. With our powers, we can't hold back, or the ones we love pay the price. I'm sorry I wasn't here, that I couldn't help you, but Metropolis wasn't your fault. I promise myself, never again. This isn't who we are. The House of El isn't ruled by fear. Hope isn't enough to save the world. Without me, they'd be dead. Think about all you've lost, Kara. What if you could have saved Krypton? I think about it every day. Then stand with me. Brainiac, he's extracting the cities early. 
Then we fight back. I must go to protect Kandak. Go. We're heading to Metropolis. What about her? All that matters now is stopping Brainiac. But when this is over, you need to choose. You're either with me, or against me. I stop this? Why won't you let me fight back? How can there be order if Brainiac wins? Humanity breeds chaos. Brainiac is order. Superman and Supergirl are almost here. The others are tackling the fleet. Shouldn't we be in Gotham? Brainiac controls the entire fleet from that skull ship. Take him down. Take them all down. Contacts, dead ahead. They gave us an opening. Locking on the skull ship. You're welcome. What just happened? Brainiac's force shield is creating a concussive feedback loop. So the harder we hit it, the harder it hits me. shield concentrates its energy at your point of attack. Move faster than it can, and you might break through. Got it. Creative. 
but insufficient. Decrease shield refresh interval to 10 picoseconds. his body. Can't hear his heartbeat. I was supposed to protect him. From this. From you. And now he's gone. I'm sure that's the best news you've heard all day. I'll miss him too. You mean that? He was a good friend once. I trusted him with my life. But the Joker got to him, and I wasn't there to stop it. I lost my friend Clark, and... I've missed him ever since. Atlantis? Gone. I didn't listen. Now, we all die together. No one's giving up yet. Anyone here from Beetle or Firestorm? This is your fault, Bruce! Cal and I would have beaten Brainiac. You should have followed our lead. Stop it, Diana! Millions of people are trapped on that ship. We have to save them. Not with him. Such discord. No wonder humans have yet to expand their civilization beyond the confines of this tiny planet. Did you call him just a gloat? My betas are taking position all across your planet. In one hour, they will explode in unison, burning the Earth's atmosphere, rendering this world a barren moon. Unless... You surrender Clara Zorel. She is Krypton's sole survivor. And my last opportunity to study the effect of a yellow sun on Kryptonian cells. Surrender her, and I will spare this world. Even if I thought you'd honor that deal, we wouldn't take it. You have one hour to reconsider. Thanks for giving the new girl a chance, but... Maybe I should go. No. We'll find a way to take down Brainiac's shields. We have to. We could try shorting them out, but we'd need to generate an insane amount of power. Perhaps science is not the answer. So he might be vulnerable to a magic-based attack. I can drive the immense magical power from the Rock of Eternity through the Gateway in Kondok, but I need an artifact, a medium to channel it. Something that can withstand the power. How about the Trident of Atlantis? Yes, that could work. We get the shields down, then what? Cyborg said Brainiac controls the ship with his thoughts. But I did cut him off from Brother Eye. It's possible I could make a signal disruptor that blocks his neural network. If you get Brainiac's shields down, we can disarm those beta bombs. Then that's our plan. Aquaman, Adam, get to Condom. The Rock of Eternity is hidden in a pocket dimension. 
I've refrained from opening the gateway to it since Brainiac's invasion. Because it would draw his eye? Precisely. Once the door is opened, it's only a matter of time before Brainiac attacks. A fight I look forward to. Ancient Ones, unveil the golden path to me. In your names, Shul, Harul, Aman, Zahoti, Atan, Black Adam has revealed Kondok's power and its location. The Society will obtain a sample of the Rock of Eternity for me. I wish to study Earth's so-called magic. The Society is disbanded. They thought Earth would be theirs to conquer, not yours to destroy. And you, Grodd? Earth can go to hell. I serve Brainiac. As you should. I will give you new soldiers. Bring me that sample before the Earth is destroyed, and your loyalty will be rewarded. Let's work quickly. Don't bother. There's no time left. Ship is on its way. Kandak will be Brainiacs. Grad will not defile Kandak. Such misplaced pride you have compared to my achievements. You are nothing, Adam. <laughs> Come out, Grodd! Face me! I require no assistance. Here comes the cavalry. Fitting that you two die together. The last of mankind's monarchs. What kind of ruler sacrifices his own people for Brainiac? My loyalty isn't to Brainiac or Gorilla City. It's to myself. I'll wait until that alien exposes his weakness and kill him with his ship. I will be unstoppable. You're deluded, Grodd. How did it feel to lose your people, Aquaman? I didn't lose them. They were stolen from me.
We thought you were dead. The Scarab's hard to kill. Batman told me you guys needed a hand. Consider me your sidekick. Come along. How does this work exactly? We imbue your trident with a spark of the rock's power. When its full might is released, it will seek out your weapon. Your thoughts will guide the wizard's power to its final target. I am ready. Neil, what are you doing? My bidding. A sleeper agent to lead you here. Despite the power of his scarab, the boy was easily manipulated. Now, Jaime, kill them. So many ways to kill you. The scarab's gimmicks are no match for the rock of eternity. Grod, you're a brute. A true leader serves his people. You only serve yourself. Be that as it may, I will be the only one who leaves this cave. You hurt my people, Grod. In their name, I will have justice. Demand justice. Against Brainiac. I've seen his mind. Felt his power. He can't be stopped. But you can. How's your head? Empty. So not much has changed. Barry! Arrow! Out of the way! Cyborg, 
Where's that signal disruptor? Coming at you. All you have to do is hit the trigger, but it only jams a local area. You need to get within arm's reach of Brainiac. Good. Supergirl, on me. Victor, help the others fight those betas. signal gets stronger this way. What is it? Voices. Millions of them. Recently, I had thought my collection of Krypton to be complete. Your capture will make it so. You have failed in every effort to oppose me. You are not exceptional. Merely an ordinary specimen of a primitive species. Dispose of him.
Kara. Captured somewhere on board. We'll find her. But we only have 20 minutes before Brainiac's betas scorch the Earth. Why aren't the others here? They're attacking the betas, just in case we don't pull through. We will. Walking bomb. How do we get past them? Swamp thing, too. Brainiac has unlocked the Green's power. He has mastered the Firestorm Matrix. All knowledge will be subsumed under his collection. A battering against a quantum vortex. Boron, indium, cadmium. That was a... Control rod. Perfect for stopping runaway fission. You have a plan? It's a work in progress. I might be able to restore them. That's new. Aboard this ship, the Green will live forever. As a digital copy, it won't be real. All nature is data. It can be stored with no loss of fidelity. That's Brainiac talking. Time to get him out of your head. disrupt their link with Brainiac. Firestorm's brain patterns are changing. I can't read what's happening to Swamp then. Jason, Professor Stein. Yeah. Yeah. We're both here. What happened? Brainiac added a third mind to your head. Like we needed that. <laughs> what is this place? Brainiac's ship. Firestorm will get you back on terra firma. Report to Hal. He'll need help fighting Brainiac's suicide betas. Sounds like a job for Firestorm. Good luck. No Brainiac. Where is he? I don't know. The ship's walls are lined with lead. Bruce Wayne of Earth, Cal L of Krypton, your battles echo across the universe. Your war has had consequences neither of you could foresee. The chaos you spread is a cancer upon the cosmos. Only Brainiac can establish order. I'll take care of this. I'll keep searching for Brainiac. Brainiac will achieve what you could not. He will quell Gotham's chaos. But for him to succeed, you must die. <laughs> I 
I don't answer to your lords of order. Go. It's over, Kent. I'm sorry for attacking. The Helm commanded me. They can't command you anymore. Both of you have defied fate. Carted chaos. But now, to see you working together again, you must keep order, or the Lords will impose it. If not through Brainiac... Even a magical being like Dr. Fate recognizes my superiority. In time, the entire universe will adhere to my design. Unless we stop you. I offer nothing less than deliverance. Your environment is poisoned. Your civilization has exhausted its resources. The Earth's decline cannot be reversed. We'll find a way. We always do. Vivisected. She has already taught me much about the nature of your powers. Allow me to give you a proper demonstration. I match your strength. You cannot match my intellect. You are only a Kryptonian, of which I have killed billions. Parents. That was for Krypton. The attacks on the fleet are weakening him. I could feel him losing steam as we fought. Good. Should make it easier to cut him off from the Betas. This is Batman. Brainiac is down. The disruptor worked. All the betas are shutting down. We did it. Now we find Kara. What's happening? Brainiac's mind is the ship's CPU. Apparently, he doesn't have a backup system. Destroyed. 
Clark, wait! You said yourself, the ship is controlled by pure thought. This could kill you. Sounds like a job for me. Bypass loop. Put the ship on autopilot. Ugh, try it. My ship! You will not destroy my village! Persistent, but primitive theatrics cannot save you. Now. Get you out of there. Not yet. The cities. You're okay. I thought it was too late, but I can feel the heartbeat of Atlantis. Brainiac's work is undone. Not all of it. I couldn't save everyone. Some cities are still trapped in the collection. Others were lost, wiped from the ship's memory. Metropolis, Coast City. But we can still save them, right? Carol? My family? I'm sorry, Hal. First Krypton, now Earth. No other world should suffer this. Clark, no. Even if I agreed that he should die, you can't. We need him alive to save the rest of our cities. No, we don't. With more time and Cyborg's help, the ship will obey me. 
Or we could lose more cities. Bruce is right. We can't be sure. What we can be sure of is that Brainiac puts everyone else at risk. This is no different than Joker. If you'd killed him, we might have- It was never that simple, Diana. Yes, it is, Bruce. Metropolis and Coast City are gone. How many more innocent people die before you accept that some lives need to be taken? Ugh. Ugh. My powers. How did you- Gold kryptonite, courtesy of Firestorm. Get up, Cal. Stay down. Enough exposure and you'll be depowered permanently. This madness has to end, Bruce. Do this. You don't want to follow Clark. I'm not following anyone. You've never understood Atlantis, Bruce. We are an ancient people with an old fashioned sense of justice. I'm tired of fighting you, Arthur. Batman knew they'd double-cross him. We have to move. There's no escape. You wish to fall? So be it. Go back to Kandak, Adam. Stay here and you'll be prosecuted. You'd have to capture me, Batman. And I've underestimated you for the last time. Supergirl, where are you? They're following me. Lead them to the cave.
How can you be against me on this? He took Coast City. Rage. Think about Carol, Hal. Brainiac has to pay. No, Clark. My rage won't bring Carol back. Just like yours couldn't bring back Lois. <laughs> My friends should be helping me instead of standing in my way. This is on you, Barry. When you defected, the regime fell. You left us vulnerable to Brainiac. You shouldn't have lost your nerve. I lost my nerve when I didn't stand up to you the first time, Clark. Don't make me hurt you. Cal! I can't forgive you so easily this time, Kara. There's still hope, Cal. I know you're afraid, for everybody. Ever since you lost Lois. I used to be afraid. Afraid my powers would make people fear me. Afraid who I'd hurt if I wasn't careful every second of every day. I spent my whole life holding back. My fear cost me Lois. That's why I don't hold back anymore! She led us right to him. It's no accident you brought us here. Of course it isn't. I warned him about Diana, but I didn't believe you'd turn on me. You should want Brainiac dead more than anyone. Instead, you're undermining me. Thank Rao your father can't see you. When General Zod tried to take over Krypton, Jor-El led the fight against him. That's who you come from. That's who you are, Cal. Not this. If Jor-El had been more like Zod, he might have saved Krypton. And I will save the Earth! I'm sorry. Your war is over. Fighting on the same side, it felt like old times. But I guess we both knew it would end this way. Do you remember that night when you told me Lois was pregnant? You knew, even before I said anything. That was a good memory. From another lifetime. I miss the people we were then. Me too. You can't win. You of all people know, Clark. I never quit. You don't have to do this. I'm not letting Brainiac live to put the Earth at risk again. Then what? I'm your next victim. I could have killed you years ago. 
It would have been so easy. So go ahead, Clark. Do it. Show me what a villain looks like. Is that what you want to see? He's still breathing. If he dies, he dies a martyr. I want him kept alive. We need to deal with Kara. She's young. Give her time. She'll come around. And if she doesn't? She will. This time, everyone will. Maniac is dead. The remaining cities have been restored, and just like I told you, Earth is at peace. Under your heel. I wish you'd come around, Kara. I'm building a new army to protect the Earth. There are billions of warriors trapped in Brainiac's collection. Kryptonians, Daxamites, Zarnians. I'll have a legion whose power rivals the combined Lantern Corps. And I want you to lead it with me. Never, Cal. You'll either make the right choice, or I'll make it for you. What's it going to be? Waller, shields down. Acknowledged. Would have sucked if you ate us, pal. Let us never do that again. Waller. I want to thank you for your service, Task Force X. What? You 
You've given us the opening. We're taking it. Your sentences will be posthumously commuted in recognition of your efforts. Impact in 10. Waller. Always taking the nuclear option. Not even mad at this point. Six, You're stuck now in your nose. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Can't be helped, love. Flash told ya. Either you wake the hell up and help us kick their super asses, or you stay out of our way. Yeah. He's still in there somewhere. No matter what Brainiac has done to them, I can still... I'll drive. have to get inside the inner sanctum uh, uh, now
Shouldn't have done that, Shark. That's Superman. He'll kick your ass. She's with us. My name is Amanda Waller. I am the director of Argus, a division of Homeland Security you've never even heard of. But we've heard of you. And I'm here to make you an offer. You're tenacious as junkyard dogs. Desperate. Hungry. You know how to survive. Now that might make you the kings and queens of Arkham, but outside these walls, the world's forgotten about you. And you're going to spend the rest of your lives picking maggots out of prison meatloaf. I could change that. I could be your way out. A chance to do some good. And if... Hey! Arkham Gazette, just a quick question. What's with the frickin' shark? I, uh, would be happy to introduce myself. That won't be necessary, King Shark. This is a microbomb injector from our friends at Let's Corp. Stick it in your target's neck, and it's good night. You want this to be where you take your last breath? No? Then help me. I only need one of you. As for the other three, you are dead already. So, show me what you got. So. Sorry. So, makes sense Waller would want the world's deadliest assassin in her pocket. <laughs> I don't know what she wants the rest of you for. Knowing Amanda Waller, it is nothing good. In my experience. What the heck is your experience? And what's the fish doing in Arkham? You got mental health issues, Shark. Generalized anxiety. But I was brought here from my home. The ocean? Bell Rev Penitentiary. Can you all focus for one damn minute. This is clearly a trap. Any of us touch that thing, none of us is getting out of here. Ah, the prisoner's dilemma. What's the bloody dilemma? This prisoner wants out. Come on, Captain. You just got here. 
I've been inside five freaking years. Feels like I've been stuck in this conversation for five years. Can we please... Oh, so sorry, Deadshot. Are we interrupting your being strapped to a gurney? Isn't Deadshot supposed to be white? Aren't you supposed to be shutting your damn mouth? Kangaroo-looking ass. Because you are Australian. Okay, so are we gonna do the murder each other thing or what? Cause I'll be straight with you. I'd kill anyone to get out of here. I'd kill you. I'd kill myself. Nobody's killing anybody. If no one goes for the bomb, Waller comes back in here, sees she's not dealing with four screw-up psychos. We all get out. So then we do nothing. Excellent. I have grown quite skilled at... <laughs> Enjoy your nothing, idiots. Maybe you should have spent less time in brain class and more time learning how to pick locks. Because it looks like Captain Boomerang. Hey, welcome back. Who wins? No one. There are bombs in our heads. Uh, we are all losers. The shark's right. She played you all. You played yourselves. Welcome to Task Force X. <laughs> one-way ticket written all over it. Walla! 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 Ah, oh, right. Oi, Walla! What the hell have you sent us into? It's a bloody war zone out here. There's a giant skull in the sky. Congratulations, Task Force X. You're the first assets to make it into Metropolis alive. We're sending a signal transponder to your location. Your orders are to activate that transponder. Waller out. Give me one reason why we should go out into that shit show. The bombs, dumbass. Morbid curiosity. Ah! Waller is not offering us a choice. I'm ready to jump off the roof now. No. No. God damn. Jump, jump. Son of a bitch. Lock me up. My daughter. Get me into this. With these assholes. I'm gonna kill you. You, uh, want to talk about it? No.
I would bring you to Hobbs Bay to save the innocents there, if I thought you gave a damn. But we all know better. Leave Metropolis while you still can. We're trying to! Oh! So here she is. Thought she'd be taller. Are you serious right now? Poison Ivy is a redhead. This is a plant. You might be the dumbest. not made of meat. Is this what you call a vegetarian option? I don't know you, but my pheromones remember you. Oh, strange emotions. Tell me about it. Wasn't expecting you to come in fun size. You really don't know me? Harley and Ivy forever? In ten story burning letters? Nope. Jeez. Lex LexCorp really did a number on you, huh, Red? He dressed you up in that outfit, too? No. I took it. When I broke out. He shut me in a room in his tower. If I worked on the things he wanted, I got a whole hour of sunlight every day. What did he want? Weapons. Making them more effective against the alien invaders. You know, they're very susceptible to plant toxins. And, um, I know all about plant toxins. <laughs> we know. That's why they call you Poison Ivy. <laughs> it's just Ivy, weirdo. Where's Lex now? I don't know. Something spooked him, I guess. He got in his big robot suit and stomped off. Ooh, I know that look. Who are you murdering? The corrupted things that are coming. All of them. They're poisoning the Earth with their gross bodies. So I lured them here. <laughs> the Wrath of Nature. I like it. Oh, this is my friend Daphne. We'll make all the aliens choke to death on spores. You make sure Daphne doesn't die, or you're next. Waller. Be advised Lex is AWOL in a power suit, and Ivy's an eco-terrorist middle schooler. Dead shot out. How'd we end up hugging a giant plant? Well, I have allergies. Anyone care? No? Task Force X, report. <laughs> Have you secured Ivy? Yeah, kind of a funny story. Good. Colonel Flagg is en route. I need a nap. And to find mean old Lex and suffocate him in a seed pod. Uh, hold that thought, kid. I just want to smush those little green cheeks. Quinn. All right, look. We're all villains here. With you so far. But injecting a little girl with a brain bomb, that seemed like a lot to anyone else. And not any little girl. My little girl. Oh, that came out weird. She is no mere child, but she should grow free. Flag's on the way. It's not like we can let her do a runner. Nah, that's exactly what it's like. I would not wish servitude to waller on my worst enemies. Me neither, mate. But we get less servitude if we grab Ivy. Then it's decided. We're low, but we're not that low. Hey! Hey! 
Okay, time to die. I'm tired of being around humans. And Daphne's hungry. Oh, I did it, okay? I put the bloody bomb in the head ages ago. What? What? Oh, I thought you'd thank me. I didn't trust her. She's a rat. 